Hello and welcome back to your own channel Indian Defense Analysis where we bring to you all the latest development happening in the defense sector. Vishorads is a man portable air defense system designed and developed intentionally by DRDO's research center Imarat RCI Hyderabad in collaboration with other DRDO laboratories and Indian industry partners. The missile is being developed for neutralizing low altitude aerial threats at short range such as UAVs, helicopters and aircrafts. In the multi-layered air defense network, Vishorad is going to be the last line of defense. The missile system is going to be a tripod launched short range surface to air missile. The missile design including the launcher has been highly optimized for portability. The Vishorad system will incorporate many novel technologies including miniaturized reaction control system RCS and integrated avionics. The missile is propelled by a dual thrust solid motor. The missile will have a length of 2 meters and diameter of 90 mm. The missile will weigh 20.5 kg and will have effective range of 7 kilometers. The overall weight of the system is going to be 40 kg. The missile will have flight time of 15 to 20 seconds and speed of Mach 1.5. It will use pre-fragmentation warhead weighing 2 kg. Its maximum launch altitude is going to be 3.5 km. The missile will feature an imaging infrared based seeker system. Now, on 27 September 2022, DRDO had conducted two successful test flights of VSORAD missile from a ground based portable launcher at the integrated test range Chandipur off the Odisha coast. As per the update from the business line, the Adani Defense has been chosen for joint development of Visorad and the firm is confident of developing a commercial version of the missile in next one year. The company was tasked with developing missile products under development come production partner that is DCPP policy. Under this policy, DRDO designs the product and hands over the drawings and technical particulars to the private or public industry to make a prototype. This prototype is then put to tests and trials. Based on the trial's outcome, these prototypes are allowed for commercial production. This was today's update. Please let us know your views on this in comment section. If you like the video, do not forget to like, share and subscribe. With this, I would like to say goodbye and Jai Hind. We will soon back with more interesting and amazing development happening in the defense sector.